Today we are working with Dreamweaver and how to style text without actually creating a new CSS rule. Now making new CSS rules for styling text like you see in front of you is very very complicated and it's much much easier without doing so. So let's get started. So welcome to Z Tutorials and as I said we're going to be styling text like you saw before you there. Now if we go into our geektalk.tk website, you can see what we made so far. And I want this little header here, Dreamweaver Tutorial, HTML and CSS website. That is our last video. I want that to be styled so that it's bold and a different font size. All that kind of stuff may be centered. Now all you got to do is highlight it. And as you see here, if I go into the properties panel and click on bold, this dialog box come up asking me and prompting me to make a new CSS rule. Now I can't actually make a new CSS rule, otherwise it'll drive me mad when I go into my layout.css document. When you go down to the properties panel, it's going to say targeted rule is the new CSS rule. You want to change that in the drop down menu to new inline style. Now if you don't have your properties panel, just go to windows and make sure the properties is checked there. Now that we have targeted rule to an inline style, we can put bold, italic, change the font style, change the font color, anything you want really and you don't need to worry about any CSS. It does it all inside you in the coding. Now as you can see I just made the font different. I made the color different. You can center it, you can do whatever you want with it. It's basically up to you. So that's basically all you guys need to know. That is a little quick tutorial on how to change the font, the size, anything you want you can center that without actually making new CSS rules. It's a very very handy tip and when I was starting out I wish I knew it a long long time ago. So thank you all for watching, I hope you liked it, if you did make sure to give this a thumbs up so other people can see it, if you want you can share it, but other than that please subscribe and see you guys in the next tutorial. This is Z Tutorials, signing out.